As a researcher on biodiversity governance, I'm interested in how international institutions facilitate knowledge exchange between science and policy. And Diversitas, over its 23 years of existence, has made significant contributions in this area. And I'd be interested to hear your thoughts on its legacy. I think probably the most important legacy is going to be Diversitas' a network of researchers. I think that, that, that is a, a facility, something ready to be used. It's already working, vibrant network of people used to work together and wanted to, to, to work together. And that, that, I think, is going to be the most important legacy. One of the aims of Diversitas is to produce policy-relevant science. Um, do you have any thoughts on the types of strategies that can facilitate this? Diversity has had a, a huge transition and a huge gradient from great curiosity-driven science um, all the way to really uh, targeted, uh, user-driven user science. So again, I think diversity has all this capacity to put um, very good, very uh, scientific expertise very quickly at the service of some of these policy relevant questions. And do you have any tips for other young researchers interested in getting involved in this area? One of the secrets for diversity success it is, was that it was scientifically fun. I've been in a number of these international initiatives, all of them are, you know, kind of very important. All of them are equally kind of important and useful, so you feel obliged. But diversity has been the most fun of them. So you don't go there like, you know, dutifully say, okay, let's, no, no. Diversity was, I mean, it had a number of um, boring things, like when we had to see the budget, when we had to see, I don't know, what, all this administration that all the uh, organisms, uh, the international initiatives have, but each of Diversitas meetings was scientifically fun, and being part of Diversitas, I felt that I was involved in a lot of fun science that really helped my career, because it was so interesting and so exciting and so cutting edge. So I would say, as a young scientist, be, uh, in, get involved in those initiatives who give you the opportunity to do, A, relevant science, but also cutting-edge science. Don't get, into, don't get involved in anything that is boring. Because, it, you know, it, it, it won't last. It won't, in the end, it won't be really useful or profitable. Great. Thank you so much for your time.